Come on, Mario. Let's do this, dude. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Mario! What's going on, ladies and gentlemen? Welcome to another episode of Pokemon Pack Wednesdays. Perhaps the return of Pokemon Pack Wednesdays? We'll see. Anyway, if you didn't read in the description down below, the, what we'll be opening up today will be the Blastoise EX Collection Box. Let's get started in just a second. Whoa! Alrighty guys, as you can see right in front of you, we have the Blastoise EX Red and Blue Collection box, which we'll be going to get started opening right now. It doesn't look like there's any real clean cut way to open this, but anyway, let's get a look at the back. Look at that huge jumbo art of freaking Ken Sugimori. Oh my gosh, look at this Ken Sugimori art right here. It's freaking beautiful. Uh, blast off with Blastoise EX, of course. <laughs> oh, sorry for the squeakiness there. It's like cardboard rubbing on hardwood. And wait, that's our figure right there. Let's get this open. And oh my gosh, we have our freaking full art hollow. Give me just a moment. We'll be back in a second when we get this thing opened. Okay. Oh my god. Alrighty, guys. After fighting through World War III, we finally were able to get the sides of this box open. Uh, let's see here. Let's get the second layer of plastic out of the way. Here we go. Oh, packs are a little loose. That's all right, though. We'll be fine. Uh, let's pop out the figure right here. So hopefully we can get a nice little focus on this guy let's see oh there we go so pretty cool i i'm not a big fan of like the eyeliner he's got going on but the water effects are actually pretty sick with the sunlight so that's a pretty good look at what this guy looks like it's going right in front of my tv i imagine or maybe right here in front and the new set that we have here i'm not sure if you guys noticed but yeah there are some new designs to pokemon back wednesdays right now um and anyway yes we have our four cards we have um Let's see what we have also in here. It's like a poster of sorts, or maybe just like some info about the set. So, oh, yeah, it looks like it's celebrating Pokemon 20, letting us know that. Oh, let's see if we can just unzoom a little bit. Yes, here we go. It's just explaining that every month there's going to be a new legendary available to the game, whether at GameStop or via download through your 3DS. So you can actually get totals of four copies per Pokemon with X, Y, Omega Ruby, and Alpha Sapphire, if you didn't know that already. So probably take advantage of that if you want to. There's a checkmark list for the mythical po uh, Pokemon collection boxes. And so it's showing each um, release it's showing that's coming up as well. Charizard, Venusaur, Blastoise, Pikachu. All really awesome stuff for generations, celebrating all of that. So sick. I already have a poster actually for these, um, the, just like jumbo size of this art, really. So I don't really need it, but I might find a nice little fun spot for it. Anyway, this is the first time we're going to be opening up generations packs on this channel, um, and in general, really for me. And there's one of every art, which is really cool. I'm super grateful for. And uh, let's see, since we're going to be Blastoise, it's a Blastoise box. We'll go with the uh, Blastoise last. Save him for last. Anyway, this is, um, let's get a close-up of the, uh, Blastoise card, though, in a moment. Let me just pop this open. All right. Let's see if we can get a tight zoom on this guy. Actually, it focuses pretty quickly. Not too bad. This is our full art Blastoise EX with Gyarados and Vaporeon in the background with Rapid Spin and Splash Bomb. Pretty freaking cool. I gotta say, and also this Blastoise EX, like most nowadays, is a basic Pokemon as well. So it's really cool. You don't have to worry about leveling up with Squirtle and Wartortle. No need for rare candies with this guy. And wow, look at the holographic art to this. It's really freaking sick. Sick. Uh, 180 HP as well. Super solid Pokemon. Um, anyway, let's get started with the Pokemon or, or with the packs already. We'll uh, go with Pikachu to start off with then. All right. We have our Pikachu right here. Pardon the zoom. Here we go. All right, I just want to really thank you guys as well for rejoining me for Pokemon Pack Wednesdays. Um, I honestly can't say how long we're going to be doing this for. I mean, I really want to be able to do Pokemon Pack Wednesdays forever, to be honest with you. But I just, to be honest with you, it's gotten pretty expensive over the time. And so I just, I'm trying to figure out a way that we can work it out to where we can still do this as a weekly thing, I'm hoping. Um, but anyway, more importantly, let's get to Meowth right here with Exhausted Tackle. We have Rhyhorn freaking rampaging through the wilderness. Ponyta Art, this is a reprint. Magikarp, <laughs> gasping for breath. <laughs> uh, Reverse Shauna, that's pretty cool. Uh, Gulpin from the Radiant Collection 2. Cloyster will be an uncommon. We have Clefable, I think this is our rare. Oh no, this is an uncommon as well, pardon me. Oh, we have, oh, wow, wow, wow. We have a Hollow Swirlix, if it'll focus. Let's see, there we go, that's a lot better. Let's see if I can get this to focus just a little bit more though. There it is. It's a little tighter. Very nice. There we go. And our... Is this a rare? Oh, yes. Parasect will be our rare. 
So cool. But you know what? We have our hollow Swirlix. That is plenty fine with me. It looks like we have like pastries in the art of the card. <laughs> Pretty cool. And it sort of looks like it's like in a jumble of candy. Probably the happiest it's ever been in its entire life. Pretty neat. Okay. Um, let's move on to Charizard. Why not? Let's do it. Okay, guys. Here we go. Let's shuffle up the, the packs. All right. So here we go. Here we go. So again, starting off with Diglett. As soon as it wants to focus. There we go. Perfect. All right. So we have our Diglett. Pikachu, look at that cute art. Oh my gosh, come on. Get out of here with that. We have a reprint of Zubat. Oh, Steel Energy. That actually looks really freaking cool. Let's just make sure we get a good look at all of that. Very nice. And we have Reverse Revitalizer. Flabebe from Radiant Collection. <laughs> looks pissed off as hell. Evo Soda. Clefable again. And oh my god, we have a, a, a rare Hollow Evil Tall. So sick. Actually, I think Evil Tall is actually an uncommon, but it's really cool because you get Oblivion Ring, Oblivion Wing, and Darkness in this cool new art form for Radiant Collection 2. I would love to run a dark deck with this Evil Tall as like just like running three of them if need be. That would be so cool. Just Oblivion Wing for days to soup up your your big boy Evil Tall EX. That would be awesome. And our rare will be a oh my god. I cannot think of the last time I saw this Tauros. It's, gosh darn, <laughs> I, I, it's leaning towards like, oh my god, maybe 10 years since I've seen this card, I, I'm sorry I'm getting like emotional over a Tauros, but it's, wow, this generation set is throwing me back all of a sudden, and I'm really grateful to it, wow, um, those of you that were around when Pokemon first came about, may understand like the nostalgia behind this and I just I haven't been hit with like nostalgia very much so to see something like that pretty amazing thank you very much Pokemon Company and Nintendo for for that little little bit there wow um, <laughs> okay and as if the nostalgia was not enough once this focuses we will get a good look at an old school friend of ours one of my favorite pokemon a pokemon card that i plan to collect each copy of for, from the card game let's see here if we can get this guy going come on baby all right yeah speaking of nostalgia here is our copy of slowpoke from like way back in the day looking spaced out as ever <laughs> our second card will be a magmar looking like it has like a huge like Flame Punch, Fire Punch coming in it's someone's way, or Ember, Ram. I'm going to say it's Fire Punch. I don't care. But that looks actually pretty sick art. Wow. That ghastly looks mischievous as hell, and I love it. Holy crap. All right. Oh, and we have another Fire Energy. Here we go. Really cool art. I love the energy for the set. I've seen them before, and I've seen Hollows, which is which are, look really awesome, too. But still, it's cool to actually have one in my hands. A Reverse Rhyhorn. Radiant Collection Esper. It's like maybe you... I was going to say it's not that creepy, but it's actually kind of creepy. It's just kind of like taking this little girl. It's just like understandably taking the sense that it's getting like... The fact that it's getting like made over right now. It's kind of funny and sad. Uh, Pokeball. We have a Haunter to go with our Ghastly. Pretty sick. Another Hollow Evil Tall. Okay, I'm on my way to making my Dark Deck already apparently. And we have a pincer rare with overhead throw and heavy suplex. <laughs> Very nice. All right. Looks, and looks like we're on to our last pack of this opening. We will have a Blastoise right here on the cover for Pokemon 20 Generations. Anyway, guys, what I was getting at earlier is just like, I, I'm really sorry that there have not been as many Pokemon Pack Wednesdays episodes as I would love. I'm, honestly, it's like one of the most it's probably my most favorite thing I've ever done on YouTube before, and I'm just really happy to have shared it with all of you. It's just that, to be very honest with you, it's gotten really, really expensive to open up booster packs every freaking week. And so, what I was wondering if, if you guys would be open to it, was it maybe like, I don't know, maybe donating possibly... I don't know uh, if you want to maybe tip me as well that would really help or if you guys want to just simply mail in packs that would super duper help if you guys are interested in that hit me up on Twitter or in the comment section I'd be happy to see what we can do with that if we can work out some sort of deal because again like being able to like present that kind of stuff to you really means a lot to me and it's one of the most like 
funnest things I've ever done in my life before. We have a hollow slurp puff, not to get too mushy. Let's look at these goofy faces right now. They're all ready to freaking get down on some pancakes. And our rare will be, oh my god. <laughs> all right, we can take that. We're gonna have our basic EX evolve into Mega Blastoise EX. I don't know if we can make things any more perfect than that. Again, guys, holy crap, we did it. We have a Blastoise EX. Guys, thank you so much. And again, if you guys are open to maybe, I don't know, sending in packs that you guys would love to um, see me open, I'd be really happy to see that happen. Um, let me know, I would really appreciate it. Thank you guys so much, have a great one, bye-bye. Hey there, guys. Thanks so much for watching this latest episode of Pokemon Pack Wednesdays. I have had such a great time recording um, it was just really fun being able to get back into it. For those of you that have been subscribed to the channel for some time or have checked out um, past episodes of Pokemon Pack Wednesdays, um, as I mentioned earlier in the video, um, it's a weekly. It was a weekly series that I shot and I fell in love with. It was a little idea I had, like let's open up Pokemon packs every week. That would be awesome to have a designated day every week to open up new cards. I love collecting, I love battling, and I know there's other people out there that love to do the same. The only thing is, I just didn't like how I approached it while I was talking. I guess I just felt a little rushed with wanting to be able to show you guys the cards, name off the cards, and just really absorb the fun of opening the packs. But I was also asking, like, if you guys wanted to send in cards, or, like, booster packs to me and stuff like that. And I just, I didn't really like the way I worded it. I didn't... I just don't want you guys to think that I'm trying to ask for your money or all sorts of things or the only way I'm going to ever do Pokemon Pack Wednesdays again is if you guys send me stuff. I, I don't want that to be the case. I don't want you to ever feel that way. I just, uh, um, just as I mentioned earlier, it, it has become a little financially expensive for me to be able to afford buying booster packs for every single week um, or, or like sometimes or like every every time there's a new um, expansion I would buy a booster box and we'd stretch that out um, for a few days you know we would do like two parts maybe up to four it doesn't matter either way um yeah forgive me if it seemed a little off of, I, I don't really like asking for charity I don't ask anything from anybody I, it's hard for me to ask favors at all um, but I just considered that since I guess there is like a donation section on YouTube that they have now and you know now you can send in tips or you know I, I considered you know over time like this is a series I really like fall in love with as I said like most of my subscribers have come from me doing Pokemon Pack Wednesdays from us opening up packs together it's just really fun we built like a little small niche community in it and I just I can't be more grateful for you guys tuning in every week just to watch me open booster packs it was so much fun and i had fun opening this again it was really exhilarating uh, and i just um I, again i just felt bad and i felt kind of guilty wording it the way i did so i'm just going to put it this way straight and simple you know short and sweet and just that if you guys want to send in packs or something or donate to me cool great awesome i'll be more easily able to afford um buying booster packs every week for the show um and but if you don't want to if you can't afford it no big deal. It just, you know, just please don't be surprised if maybe I can't have every week, you know, be a, a there be a Pokemon Pack Wednesdays episode. Um, it's nothing against anybody. It's just, you know, trying to afford school right now and everything else in my life. It is a little hard to be able to get everything done. So again, forgive me. I'm so sorry there haven't been as many Pokemon Pack Wednesdays episodes lately as I've wanted to be. I wanted this thing to like run forever you know um and, and hopefully it still can you know it, it'll just be longer stretches in between episodes um without like a little bit of help and again if you guys cannot help more than understandable but um i just you know i'm not sure if any of you tuned in to the um halloween special that i shot for phantom forces way back in the day um that's like a little over a year now um crazy to think um, like two years ago almost, I think. Um, that was really fun. And it was just like a small little experimental way of doing a booster box opening with there being like some sort of theme behind it, something fun like that. I'll make sure that that's annotated somewhere on the screen so you guys can check that out if you want to. Um, it's something really fun. And, um, it was something I really wanted to do with like pretty much every expansion set that comes out for the card game. And, um, it, again, buying cards and then trying to buy equipment to... For, for video production, it does kind of all add up and then having to pay for classes and I don't want to get into all of it with you guys. I just want to say that, you know, I do have like big aspirations and big dreams sort of what I want 
Pokemon Pack Wednesdays to be one day. And, you know, if we can be there one day, great. And, you know, if the production quality can't get to where I dream, you know, that's okay too for now. But I, I do really plan on having something really cool for this show. Um, of course, there's going to be other series. I do want to get back into Let's Playing as well, um, covering some types of news that I find exciting to me. Um, probably more towards the Pokemon side. Occasionally, you'll see some music that my band, Ivory Gold, makes every now and then. But again, I just wanted this little bit at the end of this video to be more about Pokemon Pack Wednesdays. And that, again, I'm sorry if you were at all offended or felt like I was, you know, I, I just don't want you guys to ever feel guilty for something like that. That you know, it's my issue that you know, I, I my money can only stretch so thin. And again, I want Pokemon Pack Wednesdays to be something that goes on forever and ever and ever, um, because Pokemon is a game that I love. The video game, the card game, the series. Um, it's just been a big part of my life, and I know it's probably a big part of your life since you're watching this right now. Uh, so just sincerely, like honestly, thank you so much for everything you guys do do <laughs> um, for clicking the like button for sharing with your friends for just watching that's really freaking awesome of you guys so for what it's worth if it's any consolation at all just keep being you guys and if you guys have anything to say please let me know in the comment section down below you can tweet me if you want at AJ Applesauce same as the channel name um, I look forward to hearing from you guys all the time thank you so much for everything um, one of my original fans one of my original subscribers was uh, Piplup TCG, who is an awesome YouTuber. You should check his channel out. Um, he actually makes some really sick thumbnails. Piplup TCG, if you're watching, if you want to help me out with some thumbnails, dude, maybe we can work out some sort of deal. That would be sick. Um, but anyway, a long time ago, he actually recommended a pack that he wanted me to um, open. I think it was HS Undaunted, and I ended up got, uh, getting some packs from that from that expansion, and we opened them like really early into Pokemon Pack Wednesdays, the history of it, and that was super fun. And I hope to do more of that. So yeah, even if you guys can't maybe afford to send in packs, if you guys want to recommend certain expansions or certain sets you'd like me to open packs from, dude, I am all for it. Just let me know if there's certain tins you want me to check out, collection boxes. Whatever, man. I just look forward to you guys' feedback every week, every episode. Anyway, guys, have a great one. Be you. Be freaking awesome. Pokemon, baby. Bye-bye.